All right, guys. What I have here is my favorite fishing poles. I'm from Louisiana. I'm from the Fisherman's Paradise. And uh, this is the Fluger President. I, I uh, About a week or so ago, I purchased the spin reel, the spinning one. And I'm excited to see what this is going to do. It actually has a... Uh, this one have I think six ball bearings in it. Yeah, well this one has five ball bearings, and the other ones have ten ball bearings. This is the very very first one I got one from my dad. I was fishing with my dad with a, a saltwater striker pole one day, and I, I got uh, three seven footers. I got two seven footers, and the other two are the six maybe six and a half. But uh, these things murder speckled trout. They murder redfish. I don't lose fish on it. This is my oldest one. You can see he's kind of banged up. So I got about, it's about 500 redfish on that thing. The newer one, I haven't had so much luck with this one, the newer 7-footer. I haven't had too much luck with him. I, I don't think I properly broke him in yet. But for some odd reason, this 6.5-footer, it was actually a little bit more expensive than the 7-footers. And normally, as you can see my setup, I normally go with about 12 to 15-pound tests. And I learned this from the boys in Pernilla Hash. At my leader, as you can see right here, once I make that adjustment, I drop down a 50 pound test. So I'll go 12, 15, and I always do 50. So this is 50, and this is 50. And uh, I don't lose fish. I mean, once I, you know, pretty much, if I have a good a good hook, they pretty much could cancel Christmas. But these are my favorite fishing poles, man. I love them. And I'm looking forward to, I, I'm not, I mean, maybe a Ray Fisher will deal with this. Uh, you know, these five ball bearings, five ball bearings, ball bearings. I don't know, but I'm excited about using it because I'm pretty sure it'll hold some speckle trout. And uh, on my boat, I think I'm going to go ahead and get, I may purchase one more of these. And I notice people have the different looks of the reels. But these are the ones I came, you know, I got so far. They kind of changed this one, gave it a newer look. And uh, these two have more of the old traditional look. And uh, as you can see, you got some gold hair. It's basically no gold on this one. Maybe I just fish the gold, the gold off it or something. But it's some bad boys right here. I vouch for them. I fish with them a lot. I fish a lot out in uh, Louisiana, New Orleans, Louisiana, Pernod La Hague, Saint Bernard Parish. I fish a lot in uh, the Wrigley's. I don't miss fish on them. They are awesome. I've caught Jack Ravel. I caught just about everything on them. I've caught four to fifty pound drum. I've caught bull reds. Check out some of my other videos. And these fishing poles get the job done. I fish with a lot of different types of fishing poles, but these guys have hold, held up for me, you know? So this is my collection. And when I go on my boat, I'm bringing all four of them with me.